Hey, what's up guys? Grun Hobby coming back to you guys with another baseball break, and it's going to be a good one. At least I hope it's going to be a good one. The potential's there. Let's see what we can do. We are going to do my favorite, one of your favorites. This box is just bursting at the seams. You guys can see there's actually packs just hanging out the side. The GTH baseball box is back with a vengeance, I hope, today, guys. Let's show you the background cards there real quick. I know that Mick Abel is up there in the background, the first Bowman Chrome. Uh, from this year's stock, but uh, the other card the other background card It's you're gonna be like wow. What the heck kind of comparison are you making here with pitchers? But you know what recent pitcher uh, that I picked up here and one of the all-time greats I just, I just I had to show you guys it's eating at me. I want to show it to you I picked it up from an antique store uh, like I've been telling you guys on some of these videos I have absolutely hit the lottery here as far as uh, getting lucky at antique stores and flea markets Picked up some really sick cards. I'm going to make a nice video for you guys and show you guys all the pickups all together. But uh, here's one of the ones to kind of tease you guys once again from 1961. Whitey Ford. How about that? A Whitey Ford 1961 tops. And look at that bad boy. I mean, it's a raw card. It's not in, you know, mint condition or anything like that by any stretch of the imagination. But uh, it's a beautiful card. I love vintage stuff. You know, it's just awesome to get a card like that and have it in the old PC. So, really, really cool card there for me to add to my PC. Throw him up there. And, yeah, let's see what we have here. Speaking of PC, what can I add to it today? I hope some something good because we have some insane potential. We really do. The eight packs today are just, for the most part, crazy. I mean, there's some that are, you know, not as much as the others, but you guys will think you can figure out what we got going on here. So, 2020 Stadium Club Value Pack. That's a retail kind of value fat pack, whatever the heck you want to call it. 2021 Heritage, uh, that is a retail pack. I don't know why they make it so kind of thick like that and stuff, uh, whatever they call that. 2021 Series 1 Retail Fat Pack. Here's the kind of cool stuff that goes off the pages. The 2020 Gypsy Queen, this is one of the box topper packs. So you get three, three chrome cards inside. You can get autos, parallels, all kinds of cool stuff out of that. Speaking of cool, 1989 Upper Deck. We're looking for the Ken Griffey Jr. Just like iconic looking card there. Very, very cool stuff. You know, big bucks there, obviously. 2014 Bowman Chrome Hobby Pack. Then we got a comparison. 2020 Bowman Hobby Jumbo Pack. Let's compare it to 2021 Bowman Hobby Jumbo Pack. So, yeah, some really cool potential here, guys. Uh, some exciting stuff. Hopefully we get some luck. I'll kind of do maybe this order like so. I think I'll do Heritage maybe right off the bat, I guess. And that's 72 design. Beautiful looking stuff that 72 design is. I opened some uh, 72 earlier this year, or actually last year, I should say. Last year on this channel, if you search it, you can find it. It was on a Turn Back Tuesday. Did some 72, and I'll, I'll spoil it. I pulled a uh, Roberto Clemente pack fresh. It was just insane. One of the coolest pulls I've ever had. But uh, here we go. Ty Buttry, Jason Kipnis, Brandon Crawford, Chris Bubick, Boyhood Photos of the Stars, rookie card there. Aaron Nola, the leaders card there. Nothing crazy to know. In action, Ronald Cunha Jr. Nolan Arenado and Antonio Senzatella. So nothing crazy doing there unless I missed something, but I don't think I did. Stadium Club, known for the photography. Always beautiful. But uh, in retail, you can definitely pick out some autos. I've gotten some nice autos out of this before. You get the chrome inserts, things like that. Jesus Lizard right off the bat. Jesus Lizardo, rookie card there. Luis Castillo. Chris Bryant. Uh, Travis Demerit, rookie card there. Just cool photography. Uh, Albert Pools. Shun Yamaguchi, rookie. And we got a Hunter Dozier. Bash and Burn, Victor Robles. We got Lucas Giolito behind there. I don't think it's autographs. So I always predict red foil. It normally is. And that is not, once again, red foil. So they fooled me there. Kind of, I guess, the black, I think that is. Or is that charcoal? I can't even remember. You Darvish, uh, Mike Soroka. Look at that cool picture, actually, guys. You know, fly through this. But that's just so cool, the photography on this stuff. It's just something you don't see in other things. And Zach Collins, rookie on the end. All right, let's see what we got in this uh, well, jumbo fat pack, whatever you want to call it. It's not the hobby jumbo pack, though. This is a retail pack. You're looking for those royal blue inserts they put in these. They're exclusive to this. 
Big rookie class, good rookie class. But uh, let's see what we can get out of this. Lots of stuff for sure. Lots of cards to get through. I'm going to fly through most of this. Amir Garrett, DJ LeMahieu. There's Bubik rookie there. Of course, we got to do the top slip probably at least three or four times. It wouldn't be a tops break without that. Bo Burrows rookie, Bo Bichette, future stars there. Kenta Maeda. we got a rookie of Evan White. Uh, let's see. We're getting we get those Royal Blues coming up here after we do our second top slip. Max Kepler. Luke Voigt. Nice looking Jake DeGrom there. I like that Jake DeGrom. That's pretty cool. 70th anniversary top, so they're throwing in all kinds of designs and stuff like that. But really, really nice looking stuff there, that Jake DeGrom. Yankees team card there in that Royal Blue. And then we go to uh, the 52 design there with Mr. Smile, Frankie Lindor. We've got an Evan White rookie behind there. And back to base stuff, Austin Meadows, Uriel Kennedy, the Beebs, Jake DeGrom again, and Brian McKay, Future Stars, Cunha, Mookie. There's our final top slip, I think. Edward Alvarez, rookie. And... Albert Abreu rookie, and last but not least, Tariq Scooball rookie, probably the best one, at least in my opinion, out of that pack, so there you go. Not too crazy stuff there, but I didn't really expect it. These are the packs I was absolutely most excited for, these remaining five packs. Uh, just really, really cool packs, really you know, good potential. You might hit absolute duds, but there is potential in these five packs for sure to hit something really, really nice. Still looking to pull a pack fresh. Griffey rookie out of this stuff. I actually don't even own one of these yet because uh, I'm kind of determined to pull my own. There's a nice looking uh, Jose Canseco right off the bat. Mark Grace behind there. Now let's see what we got here. We'll have a couple stickers. I believe in the center of those holographic stickers. They should be dropping out at any moment. Another Mark Grace. Right? Did we hit a Mark Grace? I can't even remember. You get doubles in these packs and it's just it's insane. Yeah, we did hit a Mark Grace. Okay. Wish I could get a Griffey. Man, look at this. The doubles are just insane that I've noticed in these packs. Uh, I just don't even know what to say about that stuff anymore. I don't think I've opened one pack of this without hitting at least two of one type of, of the same card. Uh, you got Lloyd McClendon. Man, not going to happen. Will Clark. One in that Allen Trammell there for the Tigers. Holographic stickers, give those to my son. Sorry, right, we got more of those packs to go. I will be looking for that Ken Griffey, I can promise you guys. See that Gypsy Queen box topper. Three chrome cards in here. You can get number parallels. I think you can get autos on these as well. And this is 2020, so you know, Luis Robert, Gavin Lux, Jordan Alvarez, Bo Bichette, uh, just on and on and on. We got a blue, so that should be out of 150, I believe. It's either 150 or 199 in these. I think it's 150, though. Bueller, Bueller, Walker Bueller, anybody? Uh, I'm going to pull from the back, save that blue one for last. If I can get the black, the, uh, holy heck, the back one to come apart. Marcus Simeon, and then that blue. Let's hope it's a rookie. Come on. Nope, no rookie. It's a Michael Brantley. So, there you go. Nothing really crazy doing there. And it's actually out of 99. That's totally wrong with that. 31 and 99. Michael Brantley. So, there you go. Yeah, still, those are really cool. All those box topper packs. All right. Let's keep with the chrome theme here. 2014 Bum and Chrome. It's a hobby pack. Four cards in here. Uh, yeah, Mr. Polanco there, who's just totally... All his stock has gone to kaput, rightfully so. But he was the big guy, at least that they were putting on the covers from then. Let's see what we can get here. It's going to take a lot of luck. We've got a die cut action here. It's actually the second card to die cut. No clue what it could be. Annabelle Sanchez starts us off. The die cut. Nick Castellanos. Dueling die cuts. And Jordano Ventura. I've not actually pulled one of these before. That's actually a pretty cool looking card. I like that design there. Actually, that's pretty neat. Nick Castellanos, uh, I'd say, is definitely the better one of the two. But, uh, yeah, it's a pretty cool-looking die cut. Not seen one of those before. Dalton Pompey, first Bowman. And last but not least, LJ Mazzilli, first Bowman. So, I like that dueling card. It's definitely my favorite card of that pack by far. 
Set that there. Here we go. The 2020 Bowman. We're going to go chronological order. Let's hope for an auto. I'm hoping for... Actually, I'd take an auto and a parallel. Auto in one, parallel in the other. That'd be so cool. And we have a real chance. Uh, you guys can see that different card stuck towards the top. That's probably an auto or a parallel. It really appears that way. I think it's an auto. Do you think we have an auto? We will see, though. I could be dead wrong, but I do believe it's an auto. Reese Hoskins... The Judge, Mookie Betts, George Springer. we got a rookie of Junior Fernandez, rookie of Tony Gonsolin, Yu Chang, and then the card behind it, I believe, I'm pretty certain, is an auto. Let's hope it's a first Bowman, and let's hope it's somebody big. Ooh, it's a first Bowman. St. Louis. Hey, I'll take it. Alvaro Sayos. Nice on-card autograph, first Bowman right there. It's a pitcher. Check out his uh, kind of stats and draft stuff here real quick on the back. Free agent in 2015. You know, not one of the biggest ones you can get, but still very, very nice. To pull an auto, I'll take that all day long. So, heck yeah. We got an auto. Really good stuff. And there we go. That's a nice one right behind. That's worth more than the auto probably. That Bowman throw back there, even though it's terribly off center from top to bottom. Uh, Wander Franco, number one prospect in all baseball. Very, very nice right there. That'll definitely need sleeved and cased. And AJ Puck coming at number 27 there, rookie card there. Miguel Vargas, first Bowman, paper, Riley Green. Your Encarnacion. Hey, there we go. There's a nice Robert Pawson. That's a paper. One of the big ones that everybody was looking for last year when it first came out. Grayson Rodriguez, Reese Hines, Freudis Nova, J Rod, Owen Miller, O'Neill Cruz. And we got some crumbs. Mason Denneberg, Colton Welker, come on, let's get a nice one. J-Rod Crumb is a nice one. Eric Pardino, Oscar Gonzalez, first Bowman Crumb. Then we got Jesus Lizard, rookie Anthony K, Abe Toro, Aaron Savali, Dustin May, rookie Trent Grisham, and Eduardo Escobar. So not a bad pack, honestly, not a bad pack at all. 10 strong, 2021 Bowman, Hobby Jumbo, like I said, Parallel. I'd take another auto, though, in all honesty. But uh, don't see any different card stock unless I'm missing something. Uh, you never know. Um, shoot. I thought I got excited when I saw that Sky Blue. I thought maybe we had a redemption because I know Austin Martin's a redemption in this. But uh, it's not looking that way. I think we have a like, crack ice, though, or something like that down here. All right. Anyway, Mike Yastrzemski, Bo Bichette, Trevor Bauer. Jorge Soler, we got a rookie, Jesus Sanchez, Alex Kirilov, rookie, Jose Garcia, rookie, Casey Mize, rookie, Debbie Garcia, rookie, Jake Cronenworth, rookie, Luis Camposano, rookie, Acuna, Shane Bieber, Christian Yelich, futurist of Mick Abel, Abel or Abel, oh, I, I call him uh, Abel, but uh, yeah, we got his first Bowman, so he brought us a little bit of luck, I guess, Christian Pache, rookie there in the Bowman throwback, that's a nice one, nice refractor. Josh Young, number 55 on the top 100. Then our crumbs. C.J. Chatham. Jordan Blasevich. Baron Orr. Logan Gilbert. We definitely got a cracked ice. Let's hope for, oh, who do we want? Austin Martin. Uh, Blaze Jordan. That's probably the ones I'd really like. And it's not going to be a first Bowman. It's a Ryan Velade prospect card there those are not numbered i'm very very certain let's check the back but yeah no numbering there and no numbering on the front but still parallel speaking of uh, ryan velade the paper alexander ramirez first bowman paper royce lewis daniel espino eddie diaz first bowman garrett mitchell uh choice first bowman austin hendrick james beard and last but not least brayden schumacher so not a bad break, guys, in all honesty. I'm going to say probably the winner of that break was that 2020 Bowman pack there that brought these three bad boys, that Robert Pawson, first Bowman paper, the Wander Franco Bowman throwback, and our auto, which happened to be a first Bowman, of uh, Mr. Alvaro Seos. So not a bad break, guys, not a bad break. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Please do me a favor, like, subscribe, share. Click that bell notification to button to be notified of future videos lots of them coming to you guys as always in the description below you guys can find my email address mailing address and instagram handle other than that have a great day a great night wherever you all are at and we will see you next time